So this is a wee video to go over the solutions to the Algebra 4 brackets to assignment. Okay, so question number one, you have to multiply this bracket d minus e by 4. So remember, whatever's on the outside of the bracket must multiply everything within the bracket. So this is the same as 4 times d, which is 4d, and multiply that by 4 times negative e, so that will be negative 4e. Looking at number 2, okay, so k times the bracket, so k times m is km, or you might have mk, remember it doesn't matter which order you have those letters in, and then k times negative 6, so negative 6k. Number 3, this is negative 8 times the bracket. So negative 8 times positive 3h will be negative 24h. And then negative 8 times positive j will be negative 8j. Number 4, so negative 3 times the bracket. So negative 3 times positive 2f will be negative 6f. And then negative 3 times positive 5g will give me negative 15g. Question number 5. I have negative 2 times the bracket. So negative 2 times d would be negative 2d and I've got negative 2 multiplied by negative 4 which is positive 8. Looking at number 6, negative 5y times y is negative 5y squared. Okay, remember y times y would be y squared. And then I have negative 5y multiplied by negative 6 will be positive 30y. Question number 7. Negative times a bracket. So that's the same as negative 1 times a bracket. So negative 1 times 7 will be negative 7, and then negative 1 times negative 9f will give me plus 9f. And the last question of the assignment, question number 8, negative 3y times a bracket, so negative 3y times positive 8 is negative 24w. And then negative 3y times positive 4 is negative 12w squared. Okay.